Rob Ebel here with AndersonRedskins.org. This afternoon, I'm here with... Chloe Caldwell. And Chloe, what are you doing for in the winter uh, for, at Anderson High School? Uh, I'm on the dance team. Well, I got to watch one of your routines at Seton High School, courtesy of Chris Newton, and you guys really killed it. You did a great job, and uh, you got to gotta love it when, you, when you're doing having success, right? Well, thank you so much. How was that? Was it fun uh, going over to Seton and being with your, your girls and just just having a, having a great time? I mean, every competition is a lot of fun. Seton was kind of stressful. There was a leak in the ceiling, so we didn't really know any times or where we were going to be performing. So I think we were on like an hour and a half delay, but I mean, it was still so much fun. We got to sit in a room for like 30 minutes, not knowing what we were doing, but then we were all messing around, running the dances Bonding with each other. Bonding and having a good time together, right? <laughs> yeah. So how much practice, you know, because I sit oh, and watch, goodness. I watch that video and I couldn't believe, you know, how many girls are out there? Was there 20? Uh, I think we have like 11. I haven't it seemed like, it looked like, <laughs> it looked like 20. Um, how much practice do you guys do in order to be in sync like that? You know, this is something that a lot of people ask us because when people think of dance, they don't often think of it as much of a sport. But we are honestly practicing all the time. I mean, our practices are normally like three hours long, and then we are in the gym lifting beforehand. But half of us also dance at a studio, which is normally four times. Uh, four hours a week as well so then we'll be going back and forth between the two so <laughs> wow because I'm a big college basketball fan so it, you know most of the big college uh, programs in the region have great dance teams and they come out in between quarters or at half and it's incredible what's happened to to dance teams and how competitive it is and and how uh, athletic and the moves and it, it's incredible oh yeah uc's team especially is amazing yeah it's 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 pretty special to watch so congratulations how about a Thank favorite you. moment uh for the dance team with anderson whether it was a favorite meet a favorite dance routine what uh tell me what would be a favorite uh my favorite was probably nationals last year right before going on for finals for hip-hop we were backstage and we were all pumping each other up. Now, where was Nationals? It was in Orlando. Oh, fun. It was uh, at, oh gosh, what is it called? Not Disney. What's the other one called? Universal. Okay. It was at the Hard Rock Cafe. And one of the ladies who works for NDA, which is the company we go to Nationals with, was back there. And she didn't know our team. But she gave us such a nice speech about how we should all work for each other. And how we're a family because we're together all the time. And that was probably, we went on there and we did amazing. I mean, we placed eighth. So wow. that was definitely one of the best moments I've had here. That's outstanding. So before your next meet, Coach asks you to talk to the entire team, the girls, before you guys start. What are you going to say to them? Uh, I'd probably tell them just that I love them and that they're going to do amazing. There's no really, there's not really a way they can mess up because we do this so often and they need to think like that and just to leave it all out there. We have to do we, – we always tell each other, we're like, okay, guys, one more time. You have to do it just one more time today, and then we're done. So just make this the best time you can make it. That's outstanding. Yeah, really great. Uh, all right, I know this question. You've been pondering this oh now gosh. for a half, <laughs> half an hour, so we're going to see if you've got an answer for it. So if you have an idol and you're allowed to go to dinner with this idol – I know idol, this one. Um, who who are you going to ask and why? Okay, well, I kind of have two people. Okay, it's perfect. So I would definitely, well, I already have dinner with this person all the time, but it would definitely be my mom. Okay. After last season, she had breast cancer last year and came to pretty much everything she could. Okay. She had a double mastectomy over the summer and came to a dance competition literally the day she got out of the hospital. I Incredible. mean, that woman is amazing. And if I could, I would have dinner with her and my grandma. And my grandma also had cancer and passed away from that a couple of years ago and was my biggest inspiration for dance. Awesome. I'm sure they'd love to, they'd love to hear this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Uh, free time. What do you love to do in your free time? This is the one I've been wondering about. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> I would definitely say spending time with my niece. My niece is like my favorite person. And what do you like to do with your niece? Um, oh, gosh. Well, I like to take her on walks because she's, she's really little, and okay. it's so funny to watch her walk. <laughs> like, she, she thinks she's all big and bad and likes to run in front of me, and I just think it's so funny. <laughs> it's great. Now, how old is your niece? She is, I believe, 19 months. Oh, good Lord. Oh, so yes. she's just, So she's just getting going. Oh, oh, she's sassy. She's a redhead. Oh, boy. Okay. 
That's fantastic. Well, you're going to have to play this interview back, and and she can watch you talk about her. Oh, she's going to have so many stories. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. All right, so you pull into Graders this weekend <laughs> with your niece. Oh, and what kind of, what kind of ice cream are you ordering? Uh, raspberry sorbet. Nice. And what are you going to order for your niece? Nothing. She doesn't need the sugar. <laughs> <laughs> fantastic well listen best of luck with the rest of your dance season and we greatly appreciate your time and see how easy this was oh goodness i'm almost my hands i'm sweating a bit i'm a little nervous <laughs> thank you very much you did a great job i can dance in front of all these people but doing an interview i'm like uh thank you again thank you